Hi guys, welcome back. This is Srikant. Today in this video, we'll be talking about very important function in SQL Server, and that function is null if. So let's talk about it. So what is null if? The name itself suggests that it is something related with a null, and there is a if. If means condition. So it is related with uh, the some condition and which deals with a null. Right? That's okay. So basically, null if function is the function which is use to get uh, the return value as a null so what does it mean when i'm trying to compare two value i'm trying to explain this algorithm when i'm comparing a va two values let's say x and y if both values get matched if both values get matched then it will return as a null null if if match then it will return null else first value okay so try to understand the function null if null if it deals with the condition if two value get match then it will return a null if those two value doesn't get match then it will return the first value right let's have a look I'm specifying null if function giving some value like null 1 comma 0 so now in this case both these two values are different so which value I will get I will get the output as a 1 if I'm specifying null what will I get here check out that code so it's it is the error just read the error type of the first argument to the null it cannot be null constant because of the type of the first argument has to be known right it should be known so we can't pass the null value let's say if i am specifying it as a 2 then what will i get if i am specifying the 2 it i will get as a 2 right and let's say if i am passing a 2 and in the second part for comparison i'm also passing the two what will i get i will get the value as i explained just try to revise the algorithm it will compare x and y if both value get matched it will return a null else it's the first value now both values are same just execute it when i execute it i will get the output of this function as a null so this function is very useful to avoid the situation where we see the error like divide by zero for example i have this one i'm specifying i'm creating i'm declaring one variable declare a as an int and just take it and divide it by 100 and set the value here i'm specifying as a one when i execute this query what will i get i will get at the output as a 100 right but let's say if i'm passing this value as zero what will i get i will get output as the error and that error is divided by zero encounter so we can handle this error by just by using the null if we need to have condition that when the first value is zero at the rate a is zero then it should return me null and the divide by any value by null will always give me what will always give me null you can write then condition like uh, is null to just take that value you you may specify that if the value is null you can just explicitly write as zero so this core uh, this code is written me value as a zero and this code is not error out so this is very important function null if when we have a lot of code in our procedure or uh, we are writing the big query with this kind of logic where we have to divide a lot of things so null if is very defensive function which we need to use i hope you understand and the null if function and you'll definitely understood something from this video and thanks for watching have a great day